Good morning, y'all. It is Danielle with Baker Private Consulting. I would like to address this on the post-election day where they're accumulating all of our ballots. Um, this is the first year that our government has adamantly kind of forced, hot and heavy, that mail-in ballot. And I, I want people to acknowledge and embrace each person at this moment that had anything to do with giving you that opportunity because it happens to actually be one of the loudest years that we've had for people to vote that might not have a driver's license. So you're not getting the attempted entrapment by the federal government to come and vote. If you have your license restricted but you can't vote from home, it's like attempting to get you in trouble for doing your civil duty. America is about democracy. It's not about the freedom to, to riot or protest. You can protest in a safe and civil fashion, but American, like, American history is supposed to be about democracy, where we vote for the best candidate out there. And our right to vote this year has been amplified. In, in a lot of the wrong senses. Joe Biden, he's a dirtbag. I couldn't vote for somebody like him. He has a lot of airheads pumping it right into his head. And our showboating president, 